a lot of people in their their day-to-day lives in their employment they're not doing jobs that they're happy with you know this is the reason why the 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 hate mondays thing goes around you know <laughs> don't hate mondays yeah. because so many people just dread going into work the next day so why why do you think there's that that barrier in p- people's minds that stops them to to know what they want to do and then just do it have you got any thoughts on that yeah it's you know it's not easy it's probably the hardest thing you're ever going to do um but if you truly want it you'll do it it's that simple um uh i've done awful jobs that i've woken up and i just did not want to go there you know i physically felt sick um but you do it because you've got your end goal right you 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 do the job but if you want something else no one else is going to help you so you've got to get in at five or six when you get home and instead of moaning about your horrible job, you have your dinner and you hustle to one in the morning. And then you work to, to, to make that plan happen. If you just come home and moan and wish you had a better job, then that's all on you, in my opinion. Um, because I think if you speak to anyone or anyone that's really successful, um, it's not easy. They've worked super hard for it, you know, really hard. Um, I always say to people that you can be connected and you can be, you know, put in front of some really good people. But if you're not good at what you do, that connection is worthless. Um, so you can be referred to lots of people. But if you actually aren't very good at it, you're not, you're not going to succeed. So I would also say that if you really want to do something, make sure that you go into this and you are fully committed at being the best at what you do. Um, because that's the only way you're really going to, um, you know, do well, in my opinion. If, if you just leave your yeah. job and go to a job that you or try and set up a business on the side as a side hustle and then you just try and live a great life unfortunately that won't happen it's very rare that that will happen you know um which is why the franchising model i grav- gravitated towards a franchise model because of how successful my business was becoming but i didn't want to go I didn't want to employ loads of people. I just, I just thought we're really, really busy. Um, what's, how do I grow this? Or, you know what, do I just do this? And this is fine because we've, we've got an amazing brand, good reputation, works coming in on referrals, but I guess that that's not me. Right. So I was, yeah. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't, I saw more. I, I still see lots of more and potential and the idea of mentoring someone or helping someone else create their own dream um that that makes me feel good